Ori, and today I want to talk about an important topic, especially for entrepreneurs. Here's the issue. People tell me all the time, you know, God, building a business is hard. Network marketing is hard. Motivating myself is hard, right? You get all these hard things, and guess what most people want to do is they want to avoid hard. They want to avoid the things that are difficult, the things that are challenging them, the things that are pushing them. They think that they went to school and they got the hard part over and now they want things to be easy. Now I have a news flash for you. Life doesn't get easier. You just have to learn how to work through the hard until it becomes familiar to you. Because here's the thing is staying in a job that you hate, get, getting paid a fraction of what you're worth, is that hard or easy? Answer is it's hard. It's hard to stay where you are and live at a fraction of your potential. Now, is building a network marketing business and, and motivating yourself and employing yourself and developing your skills and dealing with your emotional ups and downs, is that hard or easy? Answer is hard. So they're both hard. Staying in that unsatisfying job, getting paid a fraction of what you're worth is hard. Building a network marketing business and dealing with the ups and downs, doing it by yourself, that's hard. They're both hard. So here's my, my point to you. Choose your hard. Do you want to live with this hard or this hard? Do you want to live with you know, the, the regret of dealing with life at a fraction of your potential? Or do you want to have the satisfaction of going through and building something that you actually deserve? Choose your hard. Having somebody else tell you what to do every day is hard. Telling yourself what to do and motivating yourself is hard. Choose your hard. Right? Deciding, going to your convention, no matter what, is hard. Not going to your convention is also hard. See what I mean? Emotionally, to miss out on that, choose your heart. Which one are you going to choose? Which decision are you going to make? Stop trying to get to easy. Now, I will tell you, there is an easy path. There, there are some things that, I'll start over and say, that, say it better. Another chapter of this conversation is everything that is easy in your life was once hard. It was once hard to walk as a toddler, and then it became easy. It was once hard to ride a bicycle, and then it became easy. It was once hard to learn how to read, and then it became easy. It was once All the things that are now easy in your life were hard at one point. So understand that if you want to grow your network marketing business, if you want to grow yourself, you want to develop yourself, understand that some, you might have to go back into what they call growing pains. You might have to accept the fact that it's going to be uncomfortable in order to be able to get where you want to go. So on the first side, choose your heart. You, know, you, you, have, you have a choice of which heart you're going to deal with. Okay. Um, and the, on the second side, everything that is e now easy was once hard. So just understand, it's very difficult to accept a life that doesn't grow. I mean, it's very discouraging. If you think about a tree, a tree, you know, the, the bark breaks every winter and it expands those rings in the tree. You see those rings, that's like a person, but in most people... They, they expand only as far as they're forced to expand, and then they stop. And then they search for easy all the time. They stop work, looking for hard. The tree that continues to grow into, the, into a mighty, incredible, amazing, spectacular tree is the one that continues to grow, continues to grow, continues to go through those hard seasons in, in order to eventually get more comfortable with the new skill set. So I will tell you, speaking for me now is easy. It was once hard. Um, disciplining myself was, is now pretty easy. It was once incredibly hard. Reading and learning 
today for me is easy. It's second nature. It was once hard. But the third chapter I'll give you th for this, this week is this. First one is choose your hard. Second one is everything that is easy in your life was once hard. And the third one is, is it's very difficult to get better and look good at the same time. You know, sometimes you have to just swallow your pride a little bit and be willing to be a novice again. You know, some of you are, are top of your profession, you're top of your industry, and, it, and you, the, the, the last thing in the world you want to do is be an, uh, an amateur again, be a novice again, be a beginner again. But here's the cool thing about network marketing. It'll give you the grace to be able to develop. It'll give you a support system to be able to become more as, as, uh, as you start to build your skills, you start to build your beliefs, you start to build your mindset. It'll give you the space to be able to do it. So be willing to be silly. Be willing to be outrageous. Be willing to be an amateur and a beginner again. Understand that if you want to get to easy, everything in your life that is easy to do right now was once hard to do. And choose your heart. Which heart you, would you rather have? This heart of living at 2% of your potential, 5% of your potential, 10% of your potential, repeating the same things over and over and over again, living a life of what if and I, I could have and regret, or the hard of I'm going to challenge myself, I'm going to build something, I'm going to employ myself, I'm going to develop the skills in network marketing, I'm going to learn something that I don't know right now, I'm going to grow. Which hard is going to be most valuable when you look back on your life? Which hard is going to be most valuable? Which one is going to, is going to help you the most um, when, it, when it comes to satisfaction, when it comes to how you feel about what you do every day? I believe that is the challenging road, you know? That road less traveled, the, the road that isn't the highway, the road that's the, the rocky hill sometimes. That's the one that gives you the most satisfaction. At least it has for me. So I hope that helps you to choose your heart, to develop some, some fortitude and understand that the meaning that you apply to the struggle in your life will make a difference in how you live your dream. It's worth it. I promise. That's our show for today. Ladies and gentlemen, my wish for all of you is that you decide to become a network marketing professional, that you decide to go pro, because it is a stone-cold fact that we do have a better way. Now let's go tell the world. Everybody have an amazing day, and I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.